What's good, YouTube, man? That's your boy, Young Dub, man, coming at y'all with yet another video. Um, I have said it a while ago. I probably said it in uh, the other videos that I had a, a ton of updates coming. Uh, y'all know we recently unboxed uh, my PRV horns. Uh, that'll be going in the rear deck this year. Um, I believe last night we unboxed the uh, Crescendo PWX6s that are back there. Um, that'll be going in my doors. I uh, got another package in the day. I know y'all can see this right here, but right there uh, where my fingers at, I just got some 22 inch tires in. So that'll kind of give y'all the gist of what's going on with the car. Uh, we just, we're not going with just a um, big audio. We're going with big wheels as well. Uh, I know it was 2019, 22 inch tires might not seem uh, like real big wheels, but when they come to a Chevrolet Malibu, I, I, I think they'll fit. Uh, so that I'm gonna go ahead and keep saying big wheels because I mean 22s ain't coming on normal cars unless you got an Escalade or a Yukon or something like that, but uh, Yep, y'all know the gist of my channel man. It's car audio um, So like I said a uh, ton of updates to go uh, We got the 700 subscribers going on uh, to the end of the week this Friday the 15th. So um, in the previous video with the crescendo unboxing uh, go ahead and drop a comment from 1 to 700. A lot of y'all on top of that. So uh, keep the comments coming in with your numbers so we can get you um, um, the Sky High uh, ANL fuse holder. But like I said, um, there's going to be a lot more giveaways probably this weekend. I just I just feel like, like I said, I, I'm running out of space, if anything. So uh, why not give some stuff out? So y'all see, I'm a little dirty, man. I just got off work. Um but the reason for this video, uh, once again, comes down to the mids and highs. Uh, I'm not going to lie to y'all, I already opened this. Um, I, it could be an unboxing video, but it is, um, you know, uh, envelope, um, bubble wrap envelope. But this is my Orion TN1 um, Super Tweeters. Uh, so I decided to go crazy uh this year with the mids and highs uh so i got some orion here so we got the orion uh super tweeters i opened one of them i think i opened this one so i'll unbox this one uh just to make it good for the video here so let's take a look at it might have to do this off screen here off camera yeah this is the one i i, I don't think i opened this one so uh we'll go ahead and pop the top on that open her up When you open it, uh, it comes packed with a cardboard uh, layer there to protect the tweeter. And she's stuffed in there, man. Let me, I'm gonna have to get her out. I'm gonna flip it over a little bit here. She is snuffed. Come on now. All right. I'm gonna just have to go ahead and pull the whole damn thing out. All right, so this is how it comes packaged. Uh, like I said, I'll open the other one. So I got the other uh, manual sitting out here. Um, it comes in a baggie with the mounting hardware and um, I guess it's like a template says like us. I don't, I wanna call it like a specification sheet, but it don't tell you anything. It's just like a cutout template uh, for mounting the, uh, the tweeter. And it's like what they recommend uh, as far as like using the cap with it and like the warranty paperwork, but this thing doesn't tell you what on load the tweeter is um, Only way you know the power is based on the side of the box here um, Yeah, she might not that that writing is pretty small so she might not get it But it is uh, down here where my fingers at it is 175 watts RMS There she goes so 175 watts RMS, um, the frequency range is from 2,000 to 28,000 hertz, uh, I'm not going that high. Uh, you give me the 13K, I'm good to go. Uh, but I'm pretty sure um, a lot of y'all are familiar with this. This is the HCCA line. Uh, so this is Orion's top of the line type stuff. So there she is, man. She's like chrome with a, like a bed liner material look. Hella, hella nice, man. I mean, this this is a huge tweeter, man. Um, 4.5 inch super tweeter. 
um, they put the 700 max on there, but like I said, it's, it's 175 watts RMS. So uh, the cool thing, it does come with the cap. Um, I'm probably gonna take this off and put a different cap on there uh, from Dayton Audio just to make sure because um, the amp that I'm gonna run these on uh, it's kind of going to be the amp for everything uh, So we'll see about that when that comes in uh, we'll go from there as far as like doing updates and uh, making a decision there, but Right now uh, the plan is to go ahead and put a cap on it uh, other than the cap that came with it um, I don't know if, if it's possible that I could probably look this cap up and see what kind of power uh, it'll take in what's the crossover set on it. I'm pretty sure I could Google that and take a look at it and find out what that is, but uh, I already did order some um, some caps from Dayton Audio or Parse Express to make sure that, that she's good to go. Y'all see that, man. I mean, look at that in the camera light. It's, it's reflected like, no, tomorrow, I, I'm right right now, at, at the moment, I plan on running this in my A-pillars. Um, if that sticks and that, that continues to go that route, then gravy, um, if not, I might have to have some made and go from there. But right now, the, the plan is to run that in my A pillars. Uh, but y'all see that it's some, it's some hella reflective, hella shine. Don't want to drop that. Hella reflective, hella shine on it. So, um, I think, yeah, it must be. Yeah, there we go. It's, it's, it's connected with the magnet in the other, um, with the magnet in the other box here. I'll go ahead and open this one too. Might as well do it on, on the video. And damn, I dropped it. All right. Ain't nobody more rough on car audio equipment than me, man. But um, like I said, least the cool part, that's the reason why this stuff is all wrapped up. And luckily she was still in her packaging. So clearly that won't affect the performance of it. Like I said, I mean, if it was, I don't know, like a fragile piece of equipment, I'd be freaking out right now. But yeah, we're all right. So. She was still in the box and good to go. So we got two of these. Um, I guess I'll show the back of that. So she's completely fine. No scuffs on her, nothing like that. So she's good to go. So y'all see, um, we got some Orion Super Tweeters. We got some PRV horns. Uh, we got some Crescendo uh, PWX six and a halves. Um, so the mids and highs are going crazy. Uh, I'm not even going to lie to y'all. I, I got some boxes right there. Uh, we'll get to those eventually, man. It's some more uh, mids and highs, and uh, we'll go from there. Go from there as far as unboxing them and revealing what I plan on doing as far as doors and rear deck and things like that. So, uh, like I said, man, tons of update, to, tons of updates to come. Um, drop your numbers in the previous video, one to seven hundred, so we can get you in the giveaway. Uh, stay tuned this weekend for another giveaway. Stay tuned to the channel, period, for tons of updates, man. So y'all know how we do it, man. It's your boy Yon Dub. Any questions, comments, concerns, hit me up, man. I'll be glad and happy to hit y'all back, man. It's your boy Young Dub. I'm out of here. Y'all have a good night.